Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to Carol Seal Action Plan. This is, I'm very, um, a little nervous because Duncan is being a foolio and running around and jumping on everything. I'm afraid he already knocked my other tripod over. Just a mini tripod. This is one of the things that's keeping me from actually getting a, um, oh shit, what I just do? From getting a, um, like bigger tripod. Because uh, Duncan is a little extra at times. What are you doing? Why? I'm trying to do things right now. Okay, well, we'll do the best we can. Hopefully he won't dump everything. So this is, oh, I have to tell you something. So I went to Les Schwab today because this morning on the way to work, my uh, like tire pressure notification came out on, on my truck. And I was like, crap, I got to work. And then I went to Les Schwab in Marysville. Cause that's where I get my tires because I do financing so I can get good tires um and I park there and go into the office and then this van like parks really close to me and I'm trying to leave, leave to go move my truck to where they can uh, check all the tires and, and the guy that works there came out he's, he told them to, move, to pull away I mean they were right so close to me I couldn't pull out I could see they've been sideswiped before. They sideswiped something else before. And the guy at Lush, I was like, she's high as hell. I'm like, oh, man, it's the last thing I need is to deal with um, auto body damage right now. I got other things I want to spend my money on. So this is my um, Black Friday haul. Shit, it's kind of bad. But the first thing I want to show is I got this purse. It's got skulls. Because, you know, that's kind of my thing. It smells weird. It came from China, and um, hopefully it'll, it'll, um, hey, is my light worn out? Hopefully it will be okay, but it came with a makeup bag for the inside, and it also came with a scarf with skulls, so I can, it's okay. I'm going to use this to put my stuff in. Sorry about the lighting. My place is dark. I'm wondering if I should, hold on, I think I have another light. Duncan! No! Guys, you're killing me. I better hurry because we may lose light quickly. Okay. Moving on. So, first thing is I got a bunch of skincare. Are we focused now? And scene. This is horrible. Why aren't you focusing, camera? So I'm gonna get a regular camera at some point. Are we here? Why are you doing this? Okay, I'm just gonna move on and I'm gonna be blurry. So this is um, Drunk Elephant Skin Care. Hold on, there's more. Eye cream, whipped facial cream, and uh, this is a, a peel mask type of thing. I'm gonna do that after I, why is my shit blurry? This is not okay. There we go. Perfect. So again, Drunk Elephant Skin Care. This is a this is a Behydra Intensive Hydration Serum, and then this is the uh, Glycolic Night Serum, and the Jelly Cleanser. You only need a tiny bit. And this is um, the Shaba Complex Eye Serum. I mix this with the Vitamin C Eye Cream too, and then this is the uh, Lala Whipped Retro. Cream with six rare African oils. And then the last one that I got recently is this um, Sukari Baby Facial. And so that's like a kind of a peel that you, should, that you can do once a week. So there's that. I'm basically just pretty much only been using Drunk Elephant Skincare lately. I'm going to stick with that for about another month or so and see, you know, do a video about that. But there was this this um, sample uh, Luna Sunday Riley Retinol Sleeping Oil, um, Night Oil. I mean, I'll try it out. But 
Now onto the palettes. This is, I, got, I ordered this on Sephora because it was half price and I want to try out Violet, Vo Violet Voss. So this is the Leica Boss palette. It's not bad. It's pretty neutral. Sometimes I don't mind wearing neutrals. And then I got um, the Zodiac Love Signs palette. Look at that. So be, there'll be an upcoming video soon. If you've been here for a while, you know that uh, the original Zodiac palette was the first video I did on this channel. And, and I did my busted ass swatches for the first time. So there's that one. And then, this is an indie brand, um, the Collective Cosmetics. And what's cool is when I got they also sent like a little, little note. They had a little seal on it, and it was a nice note they wrote to me. I think that's cool. I like little stuff like that. They're a very small indie brand. They're in the U.S. and the U.K. So this is the Moon Twin palette. I like it. So on the back it says, it's too dark, I can't read in here. So it comes with, um, I've used it. It comes with two, four, 10 eyeshadows and four highlighters. Oh my God, and the highlighter just fell out. Well, I'll have to push that back in there. That was not good at all. That sucks. The highlighters are very loose. I'm gonna be able, I'll fix this somehow. If I can't, then that's a problem. But it also came with two um, two single single shadows. Then we are going to go to the uh, these are Pat McGrath dupes. So this one is called Mayhem. And then this one is Mania, which I'm actually wearing today on my eyes. I really like it. So while I am do buy Pat McGrath dupes, I also have her eyeliner, her uh, pen eyeliner, and actually like it. It's really good. Um, but I also went and got the real shit because she had a big Black Friday thing. So this is this is you know been released for a little while, but. I'm a collector, so I had to get all of them. I don't know. I guess it's like opposite of OCD. I don't know. And then here's the other one. I can't believe the highlighter busted on me like that. So this is the other one. I don't think I've worn it yet. So many palettes, so little time. And then... I got one of her uh, Blitz Trance lipsticks. This is a nice color. I'm losing my light and my mind because that highlighter fell the hell out of there. I can't believe it. And the other stuff I got was um, I got one of her, um, it's like the Dark Matter kit, like an eye kit. So it comes with these three pigments and also a um, eye gloss to go over. And then also a smudgy type of black eyeliner and a, a smudging brush. I have to learn how to use that because I just don't know. And then also I've got her a, a liquid lust kit which has three liquid, eye, uh, liquid lipsticks and a crystalline powder. And then the vinyl gloss. Man, I gotta fix this. Uh, that is a bummer. And then one of the things I got was a get free gift thing from Sephora, which has ten different um, ten different samples of skincare things. So I'll go through that at a later date. I can't believe that that fucking palette. Oh, that. But I have some small empty jars so I can put that highlight loose highlighter. I'll make it a loose highlighter so it's salvageable. It's not an emergency. And my last thing was a little science project. So this is the uh, the Melamorphosis everything. 
So when she does the pigment things like that, they come in this thing with all this glitter. So I kind of have to, because I don't want the cats getting into it and swelling these, I mean, not glitter, but sequins. I don't want that to happen to my baby kitties, even though they're kind of jerky sometimes. Well, mostly Duncan, but that's what must be why he's my favorite. So I have to so I cut, cut the thing. And then you do this with a bowl. Because for real, I'm not a figure skater, so I don't need all the sequins so much. But that's a lot. So then you go in and you pull, pull the things out. And I'll be experimenting with this stuff because I don't even know how to use it yet. But I will learn and I will share with you. Here's some Mayron mix, uh, mixing liquid, which I ordered some of this from Amazon for other purposes. For and these are the um, these sequins. I don't get it, but what are you gonna do? So I'll do these at a better date because I'm a little flustered because of the highlighter. Darn it! So. The eyeshadows in that palette are good. The highlighters are nice, but it's a little bummer that it fell out like that. I didn't even tap it. So, that is my, what else is in here? That is my uh, Black Friday haul. Still missing is Juvia's Place highlighters that I had ordered. They should be here next week. And not only that, is like a new Juvia's Place palette came out today. And I ordered it. So, I'm trying to collect them all. I'm going to depop them all. That's another project I'll be showing you. So, if anyone needs a replacement sequence for their evening gown or their figure skating costume, which I shouldn't talk shit because I just ordered a sequin bomber jacket off of a Torrid. Hey, don't be jerks. All right, thanks for watching. Have a great night. I'll probably see you tomorrow because I got lots of filming I want to do. Be nice to each other. Jesus, people. What the fuck's going on with Twitter and everything? It's all a mess. All right, have a good evening. Thanks for watching. If you even kind of enjoyed this, I'd appreciate uh, sub subscribing. Maybe give me a thumbs up. And I plan to um, I plan to upload more often now that I have a work schedule that gives me three days off in a row every week. So thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you.